pretty much. All right, let's move off of that. Let's move to the Marshall Thundering Herd. I want it to have this team a better record than I have them. Doc Holliday, man. I really like this team a lot. Went 9-4 and four last year, 6-2 and two in Conference USA. Returning starters, they got 7 on offense, 6 on defense. Holiday is 70-46 and 46 in 9 years. It, can you believe it's been 9 years that I, he's been there? I was just about to say, he's been there way longer than I thought he had. I thought he would, I thought he would have hopped to a Power 5 by now, but I, I, he's, got a, a, he's got it rolling. No, I think he's happy. Yeah. Uh, Charlotte's head coach, or former head coach, Brad Lambert, is their new defensive coordinator. They lost their defensive coordinator to Memphis. Um, I mean, Marshall was really good on defense last year. Uh, sophomore quarterback Isaiah Green, CUSA All-Freshman, he returns with a ton of experience on the offensive line, running back, and wide receiver. Defense was number 25 in the country, number 8 in the country against the run, 104.2 yards per game last year. They lose a ton of front seven experience, but I I think they've got some talent there. The schedule looks like maybe one and four to start. I mean, you got VMI, but then you at Boise, uh, Ohio, Cincy, and at MTSU. So it, at MTSU, winnable maybe. Um, it's, gonna, it's just going to be a tough that's game. A, that's a difficult front five, right? You, you're going to get the win against VMI. Correct. But then can you win any of the next four? That's what this is going to I think the goal is, this is where I don't like to say, I think they'll win this game. I, I don't think they'll win this game. I, I look at that and say, you got to come out with one. Yeah. You got to come out one and three in that four bunch. The first five games, you got to come away two and three. Like, don't even worry about the first five. Just worry about the back end. That's right. And you'll be all right. And you'll be, and you'll be good. I've got them at seven and five. I got them six and two. In the MAC, I, I, in the uh, in conference USA, in conference USA, I've got the same record. I want it so bad to get them to eight and four. I really did. There's just a couple of those coin flip games. I think, I think it's going to be tough. I think they can win at Middle Tennessee. I think they beat Old Dominion. I think they lose at Florida Atlantic. I think they beat Western Kentucky at Rice, Louisiana Tech at Charlotte, and then I think they lose at home to FIU at the end of the year. That's just how I've got it. That's right. And so you you lose to you know Cincy. Ohio and Boise, and there's nothing. And to then you lose at. to the two Florida teams. At seven and five is a really good record. And hey, here. It, I don't, I don't know that you can't win one of those games. One of those top three non-conference games. They're I mean, tough it's, teams. It's possible. They're really good teams. Upsets happen every day in college football. Yeah, and so. and Marshall is. I mean, they're good. They're good. They're good. They're good. They're well coached. They won Very a great disciplined. bowl game last year. Yeah, 